What's holding you back from investing in real estate? Hey, I'm Chase Gallimore. I'm a real estate instructor and associate broker right here at Exit Realty Shoals. I'm also a real estate investor. So today we're gonna explore this question, what's holding you back from investing in real estate? First, let's address some common concerns that might be holding you back. One of the major concerns is often the perceived risk associated with real estate investment. The truth is, like any other investment, real estate does come with risk, but with careful research and planning, you can minimize those risks significantly. Another barrier can be a lack of knowledge. Real estate might seem complex, but there are plenty of resources available, including right here on this channel, that will help you understand the basics and help you make informed decisions along the way. Financial constraints can also be a roadblock. It's essential to assess your financial situation, but remember there are various ways to get you started with real estate investing, even on a tight budget. Now let's bust some of the myths that might be holding you back. First of all, myth number one, you need a ton of money. Well, contrary to popular belief, you don't always need a massive amount of cash to invest in real estate. There are creative financing options, partnerships, and strategies like house hacking that can make it more accessible. Myth number two, it's only for the wealthy. Well, real estate isn't exclusive to the wealthy. Many successful investors started with a single property and they just grew their portfolio from there over time. It's all about strategic planning and consistency. All right, now that we've identified some common concerns and defunct a few myths out there, let's talk about how you can overcome these barriers. Number one is education. Invest time in educating yourself. The more you know, the more confident you'll feel. Consider reading books, attending workshops, and even networking with experienced investors. Number two, start small. You don't have to dive into a big investment right away. Starting small can help you gain valuable experience and build your confidence. It could be a single family home or even a small rental property. So build a support system is number three. Connect with other real estate investors, join forums, and seek mentorship. Having support can provide some insights, some guidance, and can be some encouragement along the way as well. So as we wrap up today's discussion, remember that overcoming these barriers to real estate investment is a journey. It's okay to have concerns, but it's crucial to address them and to go ahead and take that first step. If you have any specific questions or topics you'd like us to cover, just drop them in the comments below. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe if you haven't already, and hit that bell icon to stay updated on all things real estate. My name is Chase Gallimore, and I want to be your go-to guy when it comes to real estate. Until next time, happy investing.